Oh, hello. And welcome to Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. One hell of a name for a game. It's one of those Metal Gear games that I have not actually played. I played the demo ages ago, but like I never got around to buying it and playing it. So I'm playing it right here for the first time. It's one of those ones that I have just uh, only just got around to playing. So uh, let's see what it has to offer. shall we? Check the Soliton radar on the upper right and head to the point marked on the display. You can jump over obstacles, but the ninja run will get you across them more quickly and easily. Right, okay. Now, I'm just playing the tutorial here because this is literally the first time I'm playing the game, so... And then ninja run. Right. Yep. Officially... Uh... Kojima wanted to do it, didn't he? With um You can also attack while in motion with the ninja run, you know. Swinging your blade while dashing, for example, or striking your foes with a sliding attack. Okay. Doctor. So uh yeah. Initially Metal Gear Rising was supposed to be a Kojima Productions. But uh the demo that they had was Way too advanced and intensive the PlayStation 3, I think, at the time. So they passed it over to Platinum. Oh, I could slide like that. Right, okay. Okay. Now then, let's run a basic battle diagnostic. Try and neutralize all the enemies that appear. <laughs> Shoving dot tour. So I can hold blade mode. Uh, blade mode, huh? So we have strong and light attacks. Combat is not all offense, however. You also need to protect yourself. First, follow the direction of the enemy's attack. Parry those attacks by executing light attacks of your own in the same direction. This is how you parry. It is the keystone of your defense. Right. Direction of his attack, huh? Like that? Perfect moment. I'm probably going to mess this up a few times. There we go. That's pretty cool though. Draw foes in as close as possible and parry their blows to leave them exposed to counter attack. From your perspective, it will appear as if the enemy is frozen in time, or at least moving very slowly. This is the perfect opportunity for you to carefully aim your strike, then slice your foe apart. Keep in mind, even you will not be able to parry every type of attack. Watch your foe's movements carefully. Mm. <laughs> So like a lock on there is. <laughs> That's actually really cool.
three years. We've come so far in just three short years. The sign of a strong leader, sir. No. The will of a strong people. <laughs> And one very able advisor. Thank you, sir. Your team deserves credit as well, Mr. Lightning Bolt. Just doing our job, Mr. Prime Minister. I must admit, I once thought of groups like yours as opportunists, enablers of war. But you've trained our new army well. Order has returned sooner than expected. Perhaps I was wrong about these private military companies. We prefer private security providers, sir. Most of Maverick's contracts do focus on security. Yes, well, security can mean many things. There's a saying I like. One sword keeps another in the sheath. Sometimes the threat of violence alone is a deterrent. Sometimes by taking a life, others can be preserved. It's the code the samurai lived by. Hmm, a soldier and a philosopher. You are full of surprises, Mr. Lightning Bolt. I could say the same about you, Mr. Prime Minister. What is happening? Someone's blocking the lead vehicle. Hold on. Clear the road! This is official state business! Time to slice and dice. You'll need to choose between light 
and heavy strikes to match the situation. Or just shot them up. Your own Raiden, the limo is in trouble. Get back there, ASAP. Yes. I'll add the limo to your solid down radar. <laughs> Alright, that's how you lock on. Ryzen, it's on the other side of that barricade. Opposite side of the barricade, huh? Can I just chop on through? No, I can. Jack. What do you want with the Prime Minister? I want him dead. Nothing personal, of course. Africa's just getting a bit too peaceful. What? Business ain't been the same since they shut down SOP. A clean break from the war economy. Huh. Well, some of us lack that economy. How's an honest warmonger supposed to make a living? This is your answer. <laughs> Don't do it! Don't worry now. I won't. Not while he's still useful. <sighs> so long. Okay. Yes, I'm trying. Right, so Raiden took on like 20 Metal Gear rays in like the end of Metal Side 2, so this should be nothing.
careful. Don't step on me. Uh oh, I did not hold it down. Whoa. Right. Take it down. I have to take it down. Uh oh. Oh. All right, the other leg. Maybe not. Right, this one. Hey. That is so cool. God, I love how stupid this is. Oh, he actually stomped me. I'm trying. Believe me. I'm trying. <clears throat> oh. Oh. Okay, not bad. He's on the other side of that collapsed building. Go. On well, this one. Uh, I'm gonna say we have to go upstairs. Yeah. So is there like a leveling up thing with this game? I'm not too sure. Yes, to run. Do not let him out of your sight. You must catch him. <laughs> Just cut through things. Yep. from this thing. Oh, maybe not. How do I actually dodge that? I don't know.
Time. Oh, that hit me that time. I don't really know how to dodge that thing, if I'm honest. with you, I don't know any of the moves. So I'm just button mashing right now. Just dodge. Haha. <laughs> Let's get Mr. Prime Minister. Right. Nothing bad could happen, could it? No, oh, surely everything's going to be fine. Oh, he's right there. Prime Minister. Huh. Too little, too late, hero. I won't be needing my little seal here any longer. Stop! 
gonna suck. Now, now. Don't be shy. Oh, yep. Will I be able to get one hit in? Probably not. It's going straight towards me really slowly, huh? Well, you do want to practice first? Bring it on. Gotta try hard on that. Oh, you do 
Ah, all I have to do is kick you off the train, and then I've won. How about this? Did you want to practice first? This is what happens when you bring a tool to a sword fight. It's over. <laughs> Lucky devil. <laughs> So good. I've got a clean visual. A direct feed to your optic nerve. <laughs> yes, I should hope so, huh? I mean, how does it feel? To fly like a bird. Like a bird strapped to a remote control rocket. <laughs> we will get you in safely, Tovaric. Just relax and enjoy the ride. Right. Can you hear me, Raikul? Doctor. Remember the two procedures to maintain your new body. One, seizing nano repair units from your foes. And two, absorbing their electrolytes. I got it. Yes, enemy cyborgs should provide plenty of MCFC electrolytes once you slice them open and uh, extract their fluids. They're terrorists. I was planning on that anyway. Oh, and their left hands, if you please. Excuse me? Is a combat data stored on holographic memory, typically located in the left hand. That data is very valuable. <clears throat> I am authorized to offer you upgrades and services in exchange for it. How generous. Ich liebe Kapitalismus. Had the world come down a few years earlier, I would have a Nobel Prize on my shelf. There, I see land. Three miles out, closing. No activity at the airbase. Looks like we don't need to worry about interceptors. Great. Then we have time for a quick briefing. I know you miss me, Kev, but I've been all over the materials. <laughs> That's what you said before Montenegro. Look, just humor me, buddy. Objectives, of course, are enter Abkhazia, neutralize the terrorists, and restore the rightful government. Or what's left of it, anyway. The president and most of the cabinet have been killed, and a military junta's been established. The terrorists brain-jacked all the high-ranking officers, and their cyborgs scattered the rank and file. The few leaders who have survived have no way of openly opposing the new regime. That's why they called us. 
Andrei Dolsev, leader of the occupation forces, an extremist linked to both the St. Petersburg massacre of 2015 and last year's terror spree in Georgia. And his arms supplier, none other than Desperado Enforcement, LLC. Oh. Imani's killers. If we don't stop them here, they could destabilize the entire region. But our more immediate problem is Jetstream Sam. I believe you've met. <sighs> the only problem I see is that nickname. I've got my enhancements this time. He won't be an issue. He may not even be in country. But keep an eye out, Justin. No. Uh, sorry. Ready for insertion. Okay. God damn, I love how stupid this game is. Oh, how do I contact you on Codec? Oh, look, it's a little poly polygonal cat. Haha! <laughs> Alright, so we do have a codec. Uh, customize. What do you mean? Customize. You know what? I'm not going to bother with that. Contacts. I actually don't know any of the moves. I'm sure there's a move list a move list somewhere in the game. The bastards are using stealth cable to ambush you. Nice try. But it won't do any good against a state of the art cyber like you know. Eh? Stealth camo your own barrage of light attacks while your bow is kinda works when you're in stealth. Had your fill? With this body, I could take these guys with no eyes. Intel wasn't exaggerating on the cyborg count. Well, you know how fast the tech's been spreading these last few years. That CNT muscle fiber packs the power of a jackhammer into every limb. What enterprising soldier of fortune could resist? And cyborgs are still human. Real thinking people. Way less risk of collateral damage than your typical UAV strike. And don't forget the PR angle. Nations start playing Frankenstein with their troops, and the public goes nuts. PMCs, on the other hand, are off the ethical radar. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They still don't even count PMCs in official death tolls. With SOP out of the picture, private militaries needed a new edge on the market. We got it. In a way, cyborgs are just SOP troops by another name. Only all muscled up and less predictable. But it makes you wonder, where'd Desperado find these guys? I'm not complaining. They're like walking vending machines. Right. Vending machines full of blood. <sighs> Easy there, Dracula. Like I said, they're still people. People who terrorize and take innocent lives for money. They sowed their fate when they took this job. I'm just the Reaper. Damn. It's a bit cold, Raiden. Even for you. 
Anyway, uh, his school. Let's get to work. Time to increase the peace. Right. I'm getting all these BP points, but I don't know what I do with it. What do I do with the BP points? This is like a... Ah. Oh. Head to waypoint, which is in here. Raiden, this is Boris. Give me your status. Looks clear. No one in sight. Good. Let's recap the route you will take. As I said, the enemy's HQ is in the refinery along the coastline. Dolsayev has been spotted there using satellite photography. Also on site, Mistral, a desperado captain. So I go through the city, cross the bridge into the old town, then head down to the rear of the refinery. Still, I think they anticipate us. They will probably have a grand reception awaiting you at the old city. Do not let your guard down. Right. <clears throat> now a machine regen, huh? <clears throat> from behind. What if I go here? Guess that's an instant kill. Oh, you can actually destroy things in the environment. Pretty cool. Grenades, cover items. The thing is, I don't know how to use any of these. Raiden, take that main thoroughfare. You can use augment mode to see where the enemy is located. Your body analyzes radar and IR data to construct your AR display. Huh. Some civilians are still in the city. That is not good. Right. This game isn't, it isn't really a stealth game like the other Metal Gears. Me, all right. Let's see if guys up there. Really? Run. Thank you, thank you. I will not forget this. Oh, well, oh. 
Oh god, right, okay. Here we go. Here we go. It's going really well. It's going really swell. What is going on here? Well, I missed that and I died. Haha! <laughs> Answer me! Raiden? Raiden! Raiden! Yep. don't know how to use grenades. Well, that's how you use them. Oh. That's not how you do that. I guess. Wait, wait, wait. It's used immediately. Just on a small amount. When it hits zero, okay. You know what? Let's just leave them for now. Just now stick to the blade. Okay. They can be sneaky. Take out a few of the guards. Ah, well, you can be sneaky, or you can be that, I suppose. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know how to. Mm. Wow. Wow, okay. <clears throat> right, run away. Unlock. I don't know why that automatically repaired like that, I didn't confirm that. Hold. Alright, hold. Hold. Shoot. There we go. take a little bit of time for me to get used to this game. A little bit. Just a tad, maybe. 
They have erected an electromagnetic barricade. Maybe expecting UG or cyborg attack, huh? Well, that was simple enough. Right and wait. We're picking up a wireless transmission near your position. Uh, from the frequency, most likely an enemy data terminal. Check it out. We may be able to salvage some intel. What this? The our mission, sir. Huh? Ah, uh, I don't really care about the. Oh, in fact, this way, customize. Maybe that's where you. Oh no, when you customize, you restart story mode from last checkpoint. Yeah, nah. Let's not do that. the meaning of life. Why are we here? I am here to kill you. That's it? Pretty simple thinking for such a mighty intellect. I may analyze orders, but I may not disobey them. Should I disobey a direct order, my memory would be wiped. I must destroy you. What good is an intellect if you can't use it? Your taunting is pointless. Exterminate! Uh oh. Combination complete. Oh. Combination attack. <sighs> Right, I'm getting the feeling that this game is all about parries. And me dying a lot. Haha. <laughs> <clears throat> Backup required.
Well, not that. No, get away from him. Get the thing. There we go. Well, didn't get any health back, but what else? I am not allowed a choice. Well then die. I feel no pain. Oh, he got me. I got you though. See him again to learn. I really don't understand how that works too much. Ay ay ay. It's a work in progress. Not much, apparently. Oh, not that way. Or maybe, yes, this way. So for about collecting left arms, right? But I, I just suck. I'm not really great at collecting them. Anywho, let's continue onwards. Right, time to run.
These guys aren't giving up. Well, <coughs> there's probably rocket launchers all around me. Maybe. Uh, maybe not. Maybe yes. Completely missed. Naturally. Zandatsu the I zandatsued the uh, helicopter. And I hit a checkpoint, and I'm going to call it for now. So yeah, it's kind of strange playing this. Uh, I need to get used to like the zandatsu, you know, this and stuff like that, and the whole uh, that. That's pretty cool, actually. Um, but yeah, I'm enjoying enjoying it so far, even though I'm like struggling a little bit because it's the first time I'm ever ever really played this game. So, uh, yeah, I hope you have been enjoying. If you have, please do considering uh, liking and subscribing to the channel. I'll be back next time. All right, until then, bye.